This planet Earth is full of mystery. From top to the deepest point of this planet is full of mystery and adventures. Have you ever imagined how Big Bang is formed or what is there inside Pyramid of Giza? Let's keep this apart today. Hi guys, I'm Alim Ragi and you're watching Talk to Barak. Today I have come up with the mystery of the deepest point on Earth, Mariana Trench. Below about 11,000 meters of sea level exists an underwater world full of mystery and immense possibilities for scientists to research. But why are we always afraid to talk about it? Let's take a closer look to the deepest point of Mariana Trench today. More than 1500 km long and 11,034 meters or 36,201 feet depth of the Mariana Trench makes it one of the deadliest places on the planet forever covered in darkness. Interestingly, if you place Mount Everest at the bottom of the Mariana Trench, the peak would still be 2133 meters below sea level. At the bottom of the Mariana Trench, the water column above exerts a pressure of 1086 bar more than 1071 times the standard atmospheric pressure at sea level now you must be thinking how much pressure it can be right so friends you can imagine the amount of pressure you will feel when 100 elephants climb on your head it is almost next to the pressure that you can tolerate any air filled crevice of the human body would collapse in the blink of an eye under this pressure. Lungs filled with air would collapse and the bones would crush. At this pressure, the density of water is increased by 4.96%. Therefore, the temperature at the bottom of Mariana Trench can be 1 to 4 degrees centigrade or 34 to 39 degrees Fahrenheit. Scientists claim the trench was formed after the collisions of two tectonic plates, the Pacific Plate and the Mariana Plate. When two plates crash into each other, an oceanic plate plunks downward into the mantle, while the other plate rides up over the top. This movement creates a trench, where the descending oceanic plate drags down the edge of the overriding plate. However, the depth of Mariana Trench were first plumbed in 1875 by the British ship HMS Challengers as part of the first global oceanographic cruise. To measure the depth of Mariana Trench, HMS Challengers dropped lead weight attached to rope to make sounding of the water's depth. When the weight reached the floor, the crew measures the length of the rope to determine the depth of the sea bottom. Well, for a very long time, it was believed to be uninhabited with the chances of life settling in these depths being next to none. On January 23rd, 1960, a manned mission was sent to the unknown world at the bottom of the Mariana Trench. A submersible named Trist piloted by the oceanographer Jacques Picard and Lieutenant John Wars of the US Navy stirred the underwater world. But the most horrific is that both of them witnessed life alien to the humans at the time. After a descent of 4 hours and 47 minutes, when the submersible reached the bottom, Picard saw something outside. He called out to Worms, telling him that he had seen a fish within a few seconds after Worms confirmed that it was indeed a flat fish. The slit below blocked their view and they couldn't take any picture of what they had just witnessed. For years, marine biologists rejected the claim, saying it was impossible for a fish to exist under such high pressure, but the two stood firm on their account. In the year 2014, a former associate of the US Space Agency, NASA, Dr. Rem, 
discovered a Mariana snailfish at the depth of 8,000 meters. He added, it is thought that the pressure is too much for calcium to exit that would make the bones of vertebrates to dissolve but the Mariana fishes have made a remarkable adaptation. Fishes living closer to the surface of ocean may have a swim bladder filled with air. This helps them float up or sink down. Despite all the expectation, the footage that been gathered we have still only just become deeper toes into the hidden world of the Mariana Trench. It is likely that many new species await discovering and help us piece together the puzzle of how animals can survive in such extremely deep and harsh atmosphere. Researching the Mariana's microorganism could lead to vital breakthroughs in biomedicine and biotechnology and shed light on the story of life's emergence on planet Earth.